Hello everyone, Mizio here with another Let's Play, but this time I am not alone as with most of my Let's Plays because I'm a very boring person and I can't do anything alone. <laughs> I'm a lonely person. No you're not. You're the opposite of a lonely person. I'm lonely. I have no one. How are you Anyone lonely? Anyone who pretends to be my companion is What's just a liar. So yeah, anyway, we're playing Torchlight 2! Steam sale! Ooh. Steam Christmas sale, we got a bunch of games. Oh, awesome. And for anyone who's wondering, this is actually going to be filmed from General Lotha's perspective, since his computer is better. So, yeah, it, it's basically, that's... Yeah, it'll be posted on my channel, and I'll be the one primarily speaking, but he's technically recording it, because yeah. he likes to steal my thunder, so yeah. Uh, yeah, PC Master Race. You suck like that. As you can no doubt see, this game is, well, Diablo. Except with guns! Basically. Yeah, rocking the dual pistols. Okay, so I have to, okay, hold on, so I have to wonder. What do you see right there? What dropped when that guy was killed? I didn't see it. Did anything drop for you? Yeah. All the drop for me was eight gold. So I just want to confirm the fact that we do definitely have separate loot drops, right? Uh, well, let's kill these guys and just don't take anything. Wow, you do a lot more damage than I do. That's because I'm awesome. Because I, I. Hey, let's take my secondary attack in. Oh, my health is low. Wow. I just, le I just leveled up, so... How did you level up already? I'm the one doing all the damage! Because I'm awesome. I got dual pistols. It's not fair. And just like in Diablo 3, you can't just spam potions. Oh, wait, wait, come here. Come here. What? See that chest? Did you see a staff? I already picked it up. Okay, so you, the enemy do get different loot drops, which is good. You know, it used to be, I think you probably didn't have to do that, but people today are kind of dicks and they'll just steal everything. I remember one very torturous Borderlands playthrough. Not fun. We're not naming names as far as who's a dick, but, well, General Lots was in a bad mood that day. So. Yeah. <laughs> but, oh, yeah, I level up. I level up. Okay. Mm. But this is so much like Diablo, it's not even funny. But the same because this is made by the same people. Hold on, hold on, I leveled up, hold on, hold on. Hold on. I throw my shurikens at you. I guess since I'm an ember mage, I should probably level up focus. Probably. Focus. I think the biggest difference between Diablo and this is the inclusion of. Is. The me, 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 me. Anyway, I think, uh... Madmosphere. I think Ilara has probably been, uh... Using some special... Woo, let's go! But anyway, uh... Animal buddies, I like that. I have a hawk. I got a ferret! Oh, wait, one second, I need to actually start equipping some stuff of mine. Okay, let's see, I have a fire one. Is that better than... Four damage per second. Let's Ow, see... Oh I yeah, I'm gonna keep my weapon. I could use a sword, but I'm not. I really need a gem. Oh, look, I have a glowy blue weapon now. I'm awesome. I need a gem or something so I can stop it. This is something. Unfortunately, my guns do nothing, though. The guns, they do nothing. Oh, it looks like a boss. Or not a, du a boss, but at least a heavier enemy. Of course, my. Ooh, I got a Oh, you can select an item reward. That's awesome. I think that's somewhat similar. Uh, I will take my. I'll take a gun. I I'm gonna take care. the tunic. I'm taking a gun. You also get fame, which lets you unlock uh, more uh, oh, shit. abilities, which is cool. Got a new gun. What's the thing about getting a new gun that always makes you feel good? Even though this is a video game, so it kind of just doesn't really apply. You know what? I'm gonna say it anyway, cause guns. Night foe. Oh, it's a big guy. There's a big guy. He's coming right after me. Shoot him! Ah, don't be a pussy. And he died thanks to my awesome gun. Yeah, I don't think so. My big gun. I like the big ones, you know. Right. Speaking of killing for, General Lots and I were looking at mods the other day, and we actually found a mod 
where you could change the uh, trader to the trader of Resident Evil 4, which is awesome. What the hell are you doing? Yeah, although it seems like it's way difficult to just replace one thing in that. Leveled up again! Again? Are you serious? Yeah, because I'm the gun guy. So far, this game is just as good as uh, Torchlight 1. Torchlight 1, I was really surprised at how much I liked it. You know? Oh yeah, I love those too. But, yeah, uh, during the Steam sale, we actually bought both Torchlight games. Oh, I need to level up. i uh, I do too. I've, we've both been playing the first Torchlight a bunch, and it's pretty awesome. Thankfully, unlike in Diablo 3, uh, you can actually still just level up individual skills. Oh, I got a lot of stat points. I'm not actually going to put too much into strength because I have a ranged guy. That should work. Long range mastery. Actually, I got a couple of skill points. Should I get long range mastery? I'm not using... Well, plus two you're a gun guy. Long range would probably be pretty good. I'm actually going to... I'll go long range mastery and I'll wait for rapid fire later. Oh, Alright. Adventure! Oh, you've been killing everything, just getting all the XP? No. Way to go. Certainly remind me of a certain other individual. Dead Vanquisher Guard. No! What about your family? Oh. This is gonna be awesome. I now got rapid fire. This is actually exactly like, uh. Basically, right now. That's just like Diablo 3. No. That is exactly. No. I that totally is exactly not the, like Diablo 3. I am totally not the Demon Slayer from Diablo 3. That is Diablo. Did this come out before or after Diablo? I think it came out right around the same time, actually. Ah, uh, damn, so it's hard to tell who copied him. You gotta remember, though. What's your favorite? Uh, the. The other go. Oh, oh, come here! Come here! I'm coming. Where are you? I don't even see. You. Oh, you're all the way over there. How'd you get over there? I explored. Awesome, you should try it sometimes. Because it's just. Oh, gold! Oh, oh loot. Ooh, what's that? Okay. Yeah, I got one too. It's just something about, you know, loot. What What is with loot, you know? I know it's not real. I know it's just. Uh, agile light tunic, toxic health. I'm not actually going to go the socketable route. I'm, just because oh, the socket yeah. doesn't My do much. It's already socketable. Well, the socket doesn't do much if you don't have a gem to put it in. I have a gem, but I don't. I, you know, it only gives me plus weapon damage or fire armor, and I just don't bother with those. Why not? Well, because I mean, I don't need armor against fire damage, really. I don't like something that just is good for one area of expertise, you know. Better yeah. than being protected from one from one area of expertise is better than being protected from none. Yeah, but I'd rather just wait. Oh, bah, 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 I think you're stupid. Well, oh well. Unfortunately, I don't do that much damage right now, annoyingly enough. That's cause I am awesome and I'm taking all the kills. And I'm still leveling up just fast, so... Oh well, how yeah, horrid. Well. Whatever, so, man. Coach, you know, we really can't compare this to Diablo 3 simply because... Why not? Because Diablo 3, it's very general, you know, it's not generic, but it's a general style game. I mean, it's fantasy, and fantasy just ha adheres to a number of tropes. So, I suppose. I mean, like, if they literally called the main villain Diablo. I thank you for your warning. I thank you. Oh, wait, is that a guy or a girl? I can't tell. I think That's a guy. Cool. He's got a uh, beard. Okay, you have to read it then. I thank you for your warning, but it has arrived too late. This alchemist has already come and gone. It was all I could do to prevent him from entering the Enclave. As it was, many Astarans were injured. Not killed, but just injured. And since the confrontation, several more have become ill. They just, you know, they got kind of annoyed at him showing up, and they just couldn't really handle that. We're not sure what is causing it. After his assault failed here, the alchemist carried on southward towards the Temple Steps. Commander Vale and her vanquishers arrived a short while later and pursued him. They always get there late, hoping to prevent further damage. Let's see, should I get a rifle or should I get another pistol? Rifle doesn't do uh, plus two attack speed. Mm, 
I'm gonna do wheel pistols. Okay, we need to scout the Wellspring Temple and determine if the Guardian of Water is in any danger. Alrighty. Right, let's go. Oh, hey, I think look, there's an exclamation mark over here. Ah, I can't. I have to be level 5 to use the pistol. And I have to be level 8 to use my staff. Well, that's awesome. Yes. Let's see, where is a merchant? State your business. Uh. They want us to get some schematics. Grab some armor schematics. Easy enough. You have a new quest. Okay, hold on. Let's, oh, let's go. Oh. Ah, I already went. Yeah. Now, one thing that is pretty good about uh, the Torchlight games is that you can give your excess loot to your pet, and he can just pack it off back to town, which I like. Can you do that with this one too? Uh, as near as I can tell, yeah. Oh, I just. Uh. What'd you just do? Nobody saw that. What'd Stop you, looking at me. What'd you just do? I walked back through the wrong, through the exit. Nice. Nobody saw that. Stop looking at me. Going. Stop looking at me. I applaud you. Always with the skeletons, though. They are a nice, good general move. Yeah, I mean, if you don't have robots, you know, you don't feel too much remorse killing a skeleton. I will say, I do like the overall aesthetic of this game a little more than uh, Torchlight One. It's yeah, it's different, but it seems more cartoony. It really does. Uh, already this game looks like it's going to be more or less uh, like Borderlands 2, uh, for those who played it. More like the like the uh, main character, uh, the playable characters now become actual characters in this. That's exactly, that's exactly what happened in uh, Borderlands 2. Your silent protagonist actually got a voice. And actually got some characterization. That's Level 4! You are useful. I recently, Mizzy has actually been playing uh, a game called Legend of Grimrock, which yes, is absolutely I was stuck, boring. Well, I was stuck on the second puzzle for a while, and then I literally was, I, I could not figure it out. I felt so stupid because it was just the second puzzle. And Jesus. I can't figure out the second puzzle when something's wrong. But. Brush they talk to me and they're like, can you help me get it back? Uh, where? I don't even know what he's... Whatever. I think we have to get something back for him, but it doesn't give us a quest marker, so... Oh but, well. so I was literally just randomly clicking around on walls. I just so happened to click one brick that helped me do the quest. Which is... I mean, geez. How was I supposed to know that the little crack of a brick is... A button to unlock a gate. Okay? Jesus. We're just supposed to know. Yeah. Haven't you ever played a video game before? I mean, who the hell would figure that out? Well, apparently you did, because you got. I didn't figure it out. I, I, I got lucky. Yeah. You okay. saw me. I was literally just randomly clicking. Chest gold. One thing I do like about the Torchlight games over Diablo is the fact there are, you know, uh, side quests. Which is awesome. There are some side quests. Not like this, where you can, like, literally buy a scroll that lets you teleport to just a random dungeon to grind in. Now, we're gonna try to show most of the plot, what little there is. Another quest. Oh, hello, lady. Oh, hello there. And since I'm not a lady, you have to read the, uh... Wow, that... Oh, well, I love how my hawk just killed a skeleton <laughs> idly in the background. On your ferrets, it's just wandering around. Like, what you up? You must be the human Yemenistarians are speaking of. Well, I'm glad to have met you. I have been sent on a quest by Grand Regent Eldrin to recover the scroll of an army wreck stored in the vaults in the corrupted crypt here. That's weird. Why is there a comma after crypt? In the corrupted crypt here... Unfortunately, the Sturm Baron have already entered the crypt, and I have been unable to get past them. Can I ask you to attempt to retrieve the scroll? I will wait here in the path of the Eldred Dead for your return. Should you succeed, I will see what I can do to provide you with some equipment more fitting of a hero of your stature and sexiness. Okay. Too bad the only thing I want, which is that gun I can't use until level 12. Thanks, lady. Level 12? Wow. Oh, You're lame. Oh, you already went in there, of course. No, I didn't! Oh, well, I just went in there, so. Whoa, whoa, what's this? You're missing something good. Oh, well. Uh, 
Sucks to be you. Wait for me. Who the hell are you? I don't know. How do you not know? I don't know. Oh. Why do you look like that? I don't know. <laughs> I'm invisible. <laughs> what? What? Literally on my screen, I can't see my character. That's just what hilarious. do I show up as on your computer? You, you show up as like this ethereal form. I don't know what's going on. Two physical armor. Okay, I okay, I'm back. I think I'm back. Where did you go? Why did you leave? Why did you leave me here all alone? Oh look, I need to level up still. Okay. Wow, lame sauce. <laughs> okay, now this is a, basically the proverbial, you know, bread and butter of this kind of game is where you just are constantly switching out stuff, and apparently, you know, I've still got points to spend. When the hell did that happen? I don't know. I'm going to put more points into magic, but really a lot more into you know my ranged abilities. And I think I actually have uh, a few more skill points that I did not actually pay into. More rapid fire, of course. I guess, I guess I could do more magic, but honestly, I, blade pact. So there's your foes. There's nothing else you can do relating to guns. Uh, there's, there's actually I'm just looking at the other stuff I've got. I'm actually just gonna keep with rapid fire for now. That was good at Diablo three, and it's good here, from what I can tell. Rapid fire is always good in any game. It doesn't matter what game. You know, rapid fire actually doesn't make any sense in Diablo 3 or this game. Because right now we're using... Are gonna go on a rant. What? No, no, it's not Oh, boy. It's what? Let's take a second. Okay, think about this a minute. Okay, in Diablo 3, which is obviously the more popular of the two, and this is taking a long time to load for some oh. reason. There we go. That's weird. I got it almost instantaneously. But, you know, Diab Diablo 3, you know, you've got... Uh, Crossbows, you know. Peace. How is he lo firing crossbow bolts that fast? That's my question. Is it some video game? Like, how am I firing these black powder pistols this fast? I've used black powder pistols before. They don't reload quite that fast. It's a video game. Wait, so you're telling me I can't train my ferret to attack skeletons? Are you serious? Like, it's like that time they told me it wasn't butter. I know, that was horrible, wasn't it? I know. I can't believe. I don't even know what to think about so I still haven't really got that. It's just so wrong. I can't believe it wasn't in fact butter. It tasted so much like butter, but... You no, know, it was so good, and then they told me, while I was eating it, no less, and I just stopped chewing in mid-bite, and I literally threw up. All over myself. God, it's horrible. I didn't do that, but <laughs> was, zombies. It was everywhere. But anyway, vomiting aside, I just really like this game. It's just something about it that seems so maybe not unique, but just different. Yeah. Oh no, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die because I keep. I don't even know what's going on. Whatever. Rapid fire. Chug a potion. Sometimes your mouse cursor just sends you flying different places you don't even want to go to. Well, I I'm actually out of mana. Eventually, Where are you even? I think we got separated. Yeah, we did. You're you are basically a hero of another picture. Okay. Where the hell did you go? How did you get all the way out here? I don't know, I just did. We need to stick together. Oh wow, well, look, we're safer, separated by one wall. Wow. The movement speed in this game is actually a lot uh, faster than in the previous Yeah, game. I thought that was just my imagination. No, it's a lot faster. You just fly down the corridors. Why, you just left all kinds of crap for me to pick up, didn't you? Wow, well, you know, that's kind of nasty. Um, I do clean up after myself a bit more than that. Well, I mean, you're a medieval character, so you probably don't care. Even the controls are similar to Diablo 3, you just hold down on the shift uh, button and you... Of course, the controls for a game like this couldn't be that drastically different from one another. No, I wouldn't think so. Actually, I need to check my inventory. I got all kinds of good stuff here. Uh, plus actually, two. I probably do too. Yeah, we should probably actually check to see what we have at this point. 
I don't know if I really like the menus, though. Also, this is a completely blind Let's Play, by the way. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we've never played this before. I'm not sure if I really like the redesigned menu. Okay, now I'm actually going to use uh, my pet here, who actually has a different means of control. Okay, this is the best part of the game, in theory, assuming they haven't changed it. I'm not actually going to use a magical staff. If I have a choice between a gun or a magical staff, I'm taking the gun. This is literally the most boring part of the game for you guys back at home, but oh well, you just have to put up with it. So you can have your pet go to town? In theory, we're about to see. And I have an unidentified ring. We're going to take a look at that in a second. You find a lot more unidentified stuff in this game uh, than you do in Diablo. It, it, it's absolutely amazing. I know, you, you run out of I identified scrolls all the time. I mean, I never played Diablo through all the way through, uh, but... You never played Diablo through all the way through, huh? I did not play Diablo 2 all the way through, so I don't know how often you find unidentified items. Um, somewhat, honestly, about the same as Diablo 3. Yeah, yeah, I'd say about the same. Well, I got a lot of stuff I'm just selling right now. Hey, do you need Mighty Light Tunic, 3 physical armor, plus 1 strength attribute bonus, and plus 10 health? No, I don't. I got plus 16 health and plus 1 dexterity. Okay. Well, are you stationed? Yes, I am. Okay, so I got one identified Woo! scroll. And Hi, Hawk! So I guess you can send him off. I guess so. Of course, how do I do that now? This is different. Oh, um, uh, let's see what we're trying to bring up again. It's literally the little orange house at the bottom, or the green house. There we go. And there he goes. Oh, and I named uh, my uh, ferret Diablo. And I named mine Grimrock just because now I'm hooked on my game. So basically, they're both named after RPGs. Basically. Yeah, we're not nerdy at all, are we? We're doing a Torchlight 2 Let's Play. Do you even need to ask that question? Yeah, I mean, even Diablo is kind of nerdy in and of itself. Of course it is! Oh, rapid fire! Oh! Doesn't even make any sense because it's black powder. Oh, run away! I almost died. Diablo's nerdiness has never really been called into question. Let's see. Wow, that actually was. Whoa, pretty... look at that much gold! 452 whole golds. You actually get a lot less gold in this game than you do in Diablo 3. Yeah. You get, god, just insane amounts of gold in Diablo. Oh yeah, level up. Oh, well, we're leveling up pretty fast. I'm pretty sure that's going to stop soon, actually. Oh, well, of course. You actually level up faster in this game than you do uh, in the original. And I'm being beat. Come on, why is my ferret not attacking? Maybe because it's a ferret, not an awesome hawk. Uh, I will take more rapid fire. And that's all I can do. I hope you can still de-socket stuff in this game. Uh, you could in Torchlight 1, so I don't see why you wouldn't in this hey, game. Hey, do you want Agile Cloth Vest, 6 Armor, plus 3 Dexterity? Yes, I do. Well, here you go. Is it dropping on the ground? I don't yep. see it. You don't? No, I don't. Oh, no. What, do we have to do some special training? Okay, hold on. Let's see. Okay, wait. Oh, oh, wait, hold on. Oh. I have to go through this? Apparently. There. <laughs> oh, that's a good staff. Yay. Achievement unlocked, traitor. Alright, let's move out. Let's see, actually, I got this too. Let's find mana, empty socket. Right, let's go. I do like the enemies, though. I mean, it, it, it seems like a much more bright and vibrant game than Diablo. Oh, excellent. Now that one staff that I got is long range. That really is. You don't normally see that. Uh, the staffs and. Uh, you didn't drag the Torchlight 1 are horrible. At least, uh, when I tried to use them, I always died because my guy always would go and try to hit him with the staff instead of fire off a magical shot. Actually, I was doing just in the office until I can do it when I got this new staff. 
And how did you not die? It makes no sense, it's not fair. OMG hacks. Whoa! That's a lot of skeletons. God, get out of the- Oh, they're all coming after me! Oh god, oh god, no they're not! Fire. No they're not! I think you mainly got most of those kills. I think so. Cause I'm a beast! Uh, I've got double pistols, so screw you. I've got a magic staff, so screw you too. Rapid fire, pop, 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 pop. and frost. So yeah. Literally, I need to actually buy some spells. Man, my movement is so fast. It's awesome. I know. I mean that speed in a game like this really is key because it does get really boring if you're just trudging along at absolutely a snail's pace. It's more often than not more. <laughs> Admittedly, that is one big problem with Diablo 1. You can't run. So, it gets kind of... Especially if you have to uh, go long distance. Mm. Actually, it reminds me of Dragon Warrior. I almost called it, called it Dragon, but Dragon Warrior. I don't think we can get down here from here. It doesn't look like it. I guess it's over here. Dragon Warrior is a game, it's an RPG that I don't really like. I put it on the GBA. Oh, that's a boss. That's a boss. The pets don't seem to be doing too much right now. Okay, we're gonna try not to die. And we killed him. That was easy enough. Oh, you mean I killed him. I killed him, but anyway. Who killed who doesn't really matter so long as he's dead. You left a headless shrieker over here. Way to go. Yeah, well, I figured I'd leave some kill for you. Oh, thanks. The Dragon Quest, or Dragon Warrior, one or the other, I forget which, is a, a JRPG from, like, the late 80s. And literally, in order to get, I think, at least as far as I got, in order to get your magic uh, points back, you had to go rest in an inn, and usually the dungeons were absolutely massive. And it was turn-based, too. There were some enemies in that game that were kind of hilarious. Like, literally a solid gold golem. But no, like, where do you get the gold to make a golem? And why would you make it out of solid gold? I think the bear is going on. I guess he's got some bling bling going on there. Bling bling. Bling bling. Try to mana and it works on. It even sounds like Diablo. This, the mana I would know because I have my volume turned completely down. Well, it even sounds like that. Thirteen gold. What is with gold? Like, why will people such as myself just go completely out of the way for a gold coin? Like, what is so important about it? You know? Just because. Oh, it's so nice much loot! Just good. Like, how much is one gold really worth? You know, is that really worth like a dollar? A whole gold coin? Well. Depends on if you're talking this world or our world, because I would not mind a gold coin right now. Yeah, especially if it were like an ounce, because an ounce of gold at this point is like $2,000 or more. Pocket pistol, is it any good? It actually will replace my old footlock. And thankfully I can actually socket it until I get 7 fire damage. Ooh, I thought you didn't like the whole socking thing. No, I just didn't want to put it in my armor. Hey, there's a chest you missed over here. Whatever you say. I just woke them all up. I just woke them all up. They're all coming to try to kill me. Level up. to save the day! Oh, just a massacre. Don't even stop firing. Oh. Hey, let's stop to check our inventories again. Oh, after we kill these guys. Yeah, because there's a bunch of skeletons trying to kill us. Yeah, because I think I'm actually getting pretty full. Oh, I leveled up. Cool. Got too much junk in the trunk. Belt of Wisdom does a lot more than my light belt does. Uh, some nice armor, electric, an empty socket. Pants. Why do pants in all of these fantasy universes actually do all of this? Hey, how's do, are you using a hand cannon right now? Is that what you're using? Uh, no, I'm not using a hand cannon. I'm actually using double pocket pistols. Wow. Oh. Mana. You got one that actually does a lot of damage? I have 37 damage per second, plus 50 knockback, plus 3 physical damage, 1% critical hit chance, 
conveys 35% chance to stun target for two seconds. That, ladies and gentlemen, is an awesome hand cannon, and I will take that. It's two-handed. Oh. I think I'll take it anyway. Okay, hold on one second. And let me... Let me actually try to figure out... Oh, pet tab. Uh, do I need 14 mana? Oh, yeah, I do need 14 mana. That actually controls my uh, firing rate. Where the hell is the gloves? There they are. Ah, oh, damn it. If only there's a way to really quickly uh, transfer all the stuff to... Uh, plus 10 pet and minion health. Why would you ever want that? Your pet doesn't actually die. Uh, plus 4 fields of armor. Don't need... Definitely don't need a hammer. And I will put... Actually, let's see. Can I actually just take it without trading you anything? <laughs> Apparently I can. Okay, I'm going to try this hand cannon. I'm, I'm going to see just how epic it is. Oh my god, that's the greatest thing Oh I've my god. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh my god. You better thank me. Yeah, I appreciate that. It's a purple hand cannon. It's purple to me. Awesome. I will actually look through my inventory later. I just want to go kill something with the giant cannon. You're gonna have to wait for me. Cause I'm switching up my. Well, I'm giving stuff to my pet right now so he can go take it to town and sell it and give me money. Our go out there and give me money. Our Maybe. enslaved pet. Pretty this much. is so horrible. Give me more rapid fire. I'm not. I'm just gonna pour all my points in that. Let's see, okay, let me go back, and we... Oh, well, you know what? I mean, that... How does that make sense, these pets just showing up with with crap to sell? I mean, come on. Why does it not make sense? I mean, how do you train this? Does he know how to haggle? Hey, how are your uh, gauntlets? Uh, d -d 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 gauntlets... Uh, two physical aura plus 14 mana. I think you'll want these. Uh, these are three physical armor, eight mana recovery per second, plus one vitality attribute bonus, one percent increase in the amount of experience gained. I will take those. Why do you get better loot than me? Because I'm awful. I get no good loot. Ooh, I have, I have unidentified chest armor. I can amulet that I don't How's your cowl? Uh, plus two dexterity attribute bonus. I have uh, two physical armor, it has an empty socket. Plus seven health, plus one to physical armor. Give it here. I don't get any good stuff. She steals it all. Go to town, my slave. Okay. We both sent our pets at the same time. Damn, these gloves are good. I should have just kept them. Well, oh, I can't even use it. It's, it's uh, level nine. What are we doing here? I feel like... Well, let's check the map. We go... Oh, okay. I think we can go down here. So. Yes, we go down here. Wait, there's an urn. There could be a gold in there. Just one gold. Yes, just one. Oh, this... This uh, ice thing is awesome. I got 533 gold. I got 545. No, good for you. Yeah, I know. This hand cannon has next to no range on it. Yeah. So I'm thinking I may go back to my double pistols. Yeah. So hopefully I can actually hit something. Could I wonder why it says on my chat when you enter the area, Lots has entered the area, Lots has entered the area, Lots has entered the area like ten times. God. Because I entered the area. It's, it's excited about I that. I got the hit the first three times. So. You know what? It likes the fact... Oh, it's a, it's a boss, actually. Well, you think a boss is a boss? My, my pet is fleeing. Yeah, because he took so much damage, he's tired of being enslaved by you. Just keep firing! Okay, reload. Well, oh, not reload. Drink a mana potion. Okay, you focus on the boss, I'll focus on the minions. One second, I need to. Oh god, don't die! I need to rest for a second. This isn't Baldur's Gate. You don't rest. You drink a potion. I need help. What are you doing? I'm killing a bunch of guys over here, so... The main boss is coming after me. Well, hold your own. 
I'm gonna die probably. So. Oh, you'll be fine. Well, we did it anyway, so it doesn't matter. So there. Okay, we got the amulet of Anon Freck, or whatever the hell his name was. Seems like the minion. See, that's one of the most annoying things about some boss fights, where you can actually kill the boss, but then be killed by the leftover minions. I know. I that. That's not gonna happen right now, but it has happened. That's always. It's not relevant right now, but it is sometimes. Hey, so it could have happened. Two gold. Okay, another champion level boss. Seriously? Right here! He just like cursed me or something. He called me a bitch. He made me feel bad. Alright, infantry boots. Six whole gold. How could you how could I part with six golds? Take golds. I'm just gonna shoot randomly. Why? Cause it's fun. Oh no, I lost my auto map. It's gone. There it is. It's not there anymore. It's game over, man. It's just game over. It really is gone. I don't, I don't know what the hell happened to it. I broke the game. What the hell's the map? That portal looks pretty cool. It really does, actually. It's all red and evil looking. Oh, right. I think that's it for this game. Yeah, it looks like it. Too bad I can't. I don't have my map anymore. <laughs> actually, uh, if you look on this loading screen, there's actually somebody dressed in ultramarine styled armor. My thanks. Let's I see. find myself impressed with your ability, human. I must confess, when I sent you on this quest, I feared you might not return. I just basically sent you to your deaths just for the hell of it. But it stirs my heart to see that my fears were unfounded. While you were gone, I located an item that might be of some use to you. Please take it. My blessing and the thanks to the Astherians. Okay then. Woo. Well, go to hell, bitch. You will send us to our deaths. Okay then. You know what's funny? That actually reminds me of, uh... Wizard of Oz. You know? We are off the sea. No, because, you know, that's the main thing that people complain about these days, like, why didn't, uh, <coughs> loud sneeze, why didn't the witch actually, you know, tell Dorothy that all she had to do was click her heels twice and you Because she had to learn her lesson. No, she had to earn the boots. Exactly. Or shoes, rather, no boots, but she had to earn it. She had to go on a deep spiritual journey that culminated in... Killing a witch and learning just something about herself. I know that sounds inspirational, or not. I'm gonna say it does. Cause she's the best around. No one's ever gonna take it down. You know what would be the best around if I could have my map back? Hey, there's a chest over here. Oh, it's a mimic! Nice. And it was easily terminated by me. One thing I just got. Random song. But anyway. In Dark Souls, the mimics in that are absolutely creepy. They because really are. They're cool though, too. They really are. And, and then in Dark Souls, when you actually when you actually, you know, have to fight one, it's really a tough fight. I've seen you fight them before, it doesn't it? Okay, it's surprising though until you. Well, I guess not go here yet. Just oh, I just went in there. Really, dude? <laughs> I accidentally clicked Oh on yeah, it. level up. Of course, it's gotta take forever to load for me for whatever reason. No, it does. It doesn't even load that long for me. I guess because I'm recording. True, I guess. Okay, I'll be right. I'll be back. I do like the fact that. The warrior in this game can potentially wear ultramarines armor. You know what would be awesome? Is I can have my map back! Map! Oh, it's back now. I fixed it. What are you doing? Leveling up! Hurry the hell up! I'm just gonna run off. Bye bye, Mizio! Let's see, how do we get to checkpoints? Because it's actually 
probably going to have to end the episode soon just because it's running a bit long now. So. Well, I mean, we're almost to the uh, actual steps here, which is where we need to go for the next quest. So we might just call it an episode here as we cross over into the future. Oh. And so, I guess with that then we will end this. So, until episode two is uploaded, this is Mizio. And General Lots. Signing off.